Guys, how many times have you tried to go to manifest something and you get the exact opposite? And then you start just feeling like manifesting doesn't work for me. The universe is trying to punish me. And you start thinking to yourself, why does this keep happening to me? Why am I always broke? Why am I repeating these patterns? Why is my partner never there when I need them? I just discovered that those questions, those questions are literally what's blocking us from manifesting our dreams. I'm Sarah Stone Love, and my channel is all about the science and psychology of manifesting. And today's video is all about about asking the right questions. According to Christy Sheldon from Mind Valley, if you're walking around always saying, why is my life so hard? Why do I have so many bills? Why does this keep happening to me? Then that's what you're manifesting. Those questions are actually stripping away your manifesting power, and here's why. The universe loves you so much, it's actually showing you and answering your questions. So the universe is actually not torturing you or punishing you. It's actually just showing you all the reasons why to all the questions that you're asking. So now we have to learn how to ask better questions. She calls it lofty questions. Ask questions that lift up your vibration and make you feel positive. Train your subconscious to work with you instead of against you. Why do I always have more money than I need? Why is money always just falling into my lap and I have so much extra after I pay my bills? Why is my life so amazing? It exceeds all of my expectations. What is the million dollar idea that I can manifest into my life today? What kind of person can I become that would amaze the world? Why does my body rejuvenate itself every night while I sleep? Why does my body get younger and younger every year? These questions will influence the rest of your life because asking questions actually influences your subconscious mind. Remember, your subconscious is in charge of almost everything in your life, all of your patterns, your decisions. It affects your motivation. It affects everything that you do. And you can use your conscious mind to direct your subconscious. So when you ask these questions, you're asking your subconscious to show it to you. And write the questions down on paper. Your subconscious mind receives over 80 thousand thoughts, ideas, emotions, desires every single day. And if you write it down, it helps your subconscious to set a priority of what's more important to you. And if you're a person that likes to meditate, then towards the end of your meditation, just memorize like three of these questions and start repeating them and looping them. Because in your meditation state, you're actually in theta waves and you're super relaxed. You're actually bending the line between conscious and subconscious, and you're able to really impact and impress deeply into your subconscious mind. I'm going to list off a couple more questions that are really powerful that I got from Vision on Mind Valley that you should totally use. You don't have to memorize them. I'm going to put them in the description below. Why am I surrounded by bliss and happiness no matter what? Why am I able to do so much in so little time? Why am I always surrounded by amazing people that I love and feel deeply connected to? Why am I so brilliant, so genius, and able to tap into source for instant manifestation? Or you could replace source energy with God or whatever it is you believe in. I love this one. Why am I so good at making, keeping, and multiplying money? Why does the universe always have my back? Why do I always solve problems in a fun and easy way? And why do my dreams and goals come to me in such ease and speed? Whatever you believe and assume about yourself and the world is what will come true for you. I'm Sarah Stone Love. I hope this really helps you. I find it so simple and so exciting. The questions are the answers. If you like the video, please share, subscribe, and leave me a comment. I'm really interested in what questions you're going to ask yourself. And join me every Tuesday and Thursday. We'll be sharing more content on how to manifest your dreams.